everyone, here is the storyline of the episode that aired last night. At the beginning of the episode, Wuju was not honest with Wu Jin about his illness. He only said that he was too stressed, but Wu Jin did not believe him easily because he had heard and seen Wuju vomiting in the middle of the night several times. Su Jong also ordered the confiscation of all of Han Yang's assets so that Han Yang would not have a single asset. Su Jong told Yara that at least she had to take all the money stolen by Han Yang because she could not imprison her. This really upset Yara. She asked Secretary Jiang to convince King Ha to expel Lui Ju, Su Jiang, and Yang A from the Ju family home. King Ha actually wanted Lui Ju, Yang A, and Su Jiang to leave the Ju family home, not because she wanted to fulfill Yara's request, but because she planned to move Jerim to the Ju family home so that she could continue to monitor her health condition and prevent her from recovering. King Ha's way of kicking Wei Ju out was by saying that Su Jong and Wu Jin used to date and now Wu Jin felt uncomfortable living in the same house with Su Jong. That's why Wu Jin often didn't come home. But Wei Ju told King Ha that before Su Jong lived in the Ju family's house, Wujin often didn't come home, so Su Jung's presence in the Ju family's house was not the reason Wujin often didn't come home. Besides that, Wujin told Kyu Ha that he would never leave the Ju family's house because that house was the first house he owned under his name. Then Kyu Ha received a phone call from Dr. Kim where Dr. Kim said that Jarim's condition was getting better and would recover soon. Hearing that made Kyu Ha move Jarim to the Ju family's house faster. Wei Ju, who knew this, became very angry. He kicked Kyu Ha out of the Ju family's house and he no longer pretended to have amnesia. He told Kyung Ha that he remembered everything she had ever done to Su Jong and Yao A. He remembered everything without exception. Besides that, in this episode, there was also Hiera who was getting more and more rude to Hamin. Besides taking Jiwoo's photo from Hamin, Hiera also used Hamin for her own interest. She forced Hamin to contact Wu Jin and told Wu Jin to go home. She also forbade Hamin to continue playing with Su Jong. Okay everyone, that's the storyline this time. Thank you for watching my video.